Hey guys, Nick Miller today from Mark Supply Company. Today I have for you a 2019 Kubota SSV65 rubber tire and skid steer loader. Uh, this unit is loaded up, got cab, heat, air, power quick touch, two speed, power quick, um, KSR, Kubota shockless ride, pilot controls. So this is what they call an SSV65 PC, pilot controlled cab. Um, Brand new 10-16-5 tires on it, uh, cab heat air, again, all the glasses in the cab, very nice machine, original uh, Kubota uh, OEM 68 inch bucket with smooth edge uh, on it, bolt on cutting edge and the side cutters. Uh, very nice machine, I have a pair of these, we're brothers, uh, come from one place, uh, took very good care and very good maintenance of their machines. Uh, we have done a complete and full service, all the fillers and oils have been changed and it is ready to go to work. We're going to start right back here in the uh, engine compartment. We'll take a complete around of this machine. So, this machine is going to be powered by a Kubota um, four cylinder turbo diesel engine. I think these are a 2607 in these. V2607 four cylinder turbo diesel engine. Uh, we did change all the fillers and oils, all the fillers with OEM Kubotas. We did air, fuel, hydraulic, engine oil, um, pilot filter. And whatever it called for, including cabin filled, we went ahead and did that. That way they were done. Okay. Uh, a lot of guys question us that we do that. We do do service work on our stuff because we want it to be serviced. I don't want any regrets of not doing it. Cab heat air up here is going to be your condenser, your radiator cooling package. Everything is in here. Doors in the air. Fuel tank is in the rear door. Everything air shuts nice. No cylinders have any leaks. There's no aftermarket welding, brakes, uh, anything like that. Bucket is in good shape. Again, bolt on cutting edge, corner side cutters. The, the, all the paint is original on this machine, except for we did paint the quick attach just from being chipped up. Um, power quick attach, everything there works. Quick attach is good and tight yet. This machine, this is the one I made a mistake in my other video. This is the one that had a <clears throat> bad. Uh, two couplers here. We went ahead and replaced the whole block valve, uh, new bolts, block valve, everything. Uh, grab handles are in very nice shape. There's one ding right here in this one. Um, getting into the cab, one nice thing on the Kubota is you do have your nice overhead door. Um, very easy in and out, very nice access inside and out of the machine. Um, suspension seat, again, it is pilot controls. There is both these machines, same spot. Two little cracks in the seat. The rest of the seat's in beautiful shape. New cabin filters. We go ahead. I'll show you here everything. 2,567 hours. There is no warning lights. We go ahead and show you there. Uh, no warning errors coming up. There is your Kubota shockless ride. There's your two speed. Um, again, machine is cab. I'm sorry, Matt. Joystick control, you have your foot throttle down here, auto level, power quick attach, everything is there. AC, all the vents, louvers, everything there is complete um, and in it, nothing smashed out. One big thing in these Kubotas, I'll tell you what, door access is unbelievable, beautiful. Uh, very, very nice design. Shocks are good in the doors. Um, these are nice machines. They have a few hours on them, but that's actually relatively low hours. Took some stuff I'm seeing, four and 5,000 hours. Um, really, really nice, well cared for machines. They are original paint. Other than we did paint the quick attaches in the buckets. Brand new tires on this machine. We're going to fire it up. We're going to run around. She does everything it's supposed to do. Here we go. So. Like we said earlier, big thing we do do with all of our equipment, we do service everything. Uh, filters, oils, make sure there's no leaks. Now, there is guys out there that they say they put it through the shop, and all that means is, is they run it in one door and out the other. So, um, that's our opinion. I like to get through and do, do work so that we don't have problems. I don't want anybody having problems. Um, but we try our best to get through stuff so we know what's what. I like to take care of stuff like that so that we don't have an issue. Born. Um, 
we are in single speed. I'm gonna go ahead, shift into two speed. Shift back out, we'll go ahead and back up. Two speed. And again, these are a very nice running working machine. And again, these were cared for the units. They're not all smashed up. We're gonna go ahead and I'll turn to the left and the right, and you can see that the boom is not all sloughed out of this thing. about the Kubota, in my opinion, it's a very, very simple machine as far as working on it, keeping your maintenance up, they're very easy to work on. Um, the Kubota engine at 2607 has been in a ton of equipment for years. Uh, Bobcat used that themselves, your late model T180s, T190s, um, S205s. Uh, 185s. It had 2607s in them. Then the generation um, of the early M's had 2607 engines. Very, very good motors. And everybody has to realize that uh, Kubota builds a lot of you know power units for companies. Um, They've been in that industry for many, 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 many years. Like these windows are nice, you can see in and out. They open nice, you can um, get good visibility out of these machines. We always like to unhook power quick touch here, show customers that hey, this actually does work. Boat has a nice heavy quick touch. Good practices, always check to make sure you lock those pins. back here and clean up my mess I made. But again, very, very nice running working machine. I hope everybody can see that. We take a lot of time and a lot of pride in what we're doing here as far as uh, going through and showing everybody that stuff works. Um, 2,567 hours, cab heat air, pilot controls, uh, power quick attach two speed, uh, Kubota shockless ride. One nice thing when you get out, you can run this machine with that cab door up, uh, which is nice. You can get in and out doing that. A lot of people also forget there's a little button you can push right there. It's going to unlatch that door when you step down. Give it a good push, and away you go. It's taken care of. Um, guys, if you have any questions, I have a pair of these for sale. Um, brand new tires on this one. The other one has probably 90% rubber. Factory buckets. 
Um, this one's a 2019, the other one's a 2018. Uh, really good running working machines. If you have any questions, 814-658-3066. Please check out our website, www.marksupplyco.com. We're glad to help with any, any uh, questions you might have. You need a shipping quote, we're glad to help you with that. Again, I'm Nick Miller, 814-658-3066. As always, thanks for checking out Mark Supply Company. Have a great day.